Hi guys, Flying Fish here, and welcome back to another Dokkan Battle Epic Easy A uh, Battle video. Uh, we are jumping into the Dragon Ball Heroes Edition Easy A. Uh, this is a really interesting Easy A we have right in front of us because uh, this is one of those where the characters you fight, uh, ch they change pretty much every battle, uh, actually. Uh, this will make it easier. Uh, there we go, we got our trunkses. So because we're fighting so many different like types of characters here, uh, yeah, see, there we go. Uh, we went from fighting a AGL enemy to an int enemy, and we have a full tech rotation, so I'm just going to do a little bit of this now that we have this information, and we're going to bring the uh, physical Super Saiyan 4 Vegito Frank Hoid instead. Uh, yeah, and so this is going to be common, as you can see. Uh, we fight all different kinds of enemies. I'm assuming this Go Tanks is the last one, possibly. Uh, yeah, so we have like Int, AGL, AGL, STR, AGL, Int, Tech. So, uh, you're gonna want a large variety of what category- the Dragon Ball Heroes category. That is one unfortunate thing about this event, that they are making you run Dragon Ball Heroes. And I know not many people actually are able to run like full Dragon Ball Hero teams because I mean this is a very this is a very limited cast of characters because they're all not only is this list I feel like pretty small I mean like 56 characters and I have like a few extras in here from like SSRs and stuff but uh these characters are only around like once a year and then uh <laughs> yeah have fun getting them again after that so uh we're gonna be able to run a almost all physical team here yeah we could run we could run an actual full physical team but i like mechi kabora or mechi kabora i have i still have no idea how that's pronounced so yep here we go we're going to jump into super saiyan 3 gohan and another thing about these events i feel like this hero's easy i feel like they knew the developers knew that a lot of people weren't going to have all these characters and they made this a bit easier because i saw i saw someone on the subreddit posted that oh wow thanks vegeto uh 50 chance counter yeah thank you someone on the subreddit posted that they had like brute force this event with goku's family with like zero like absolutely zero <laughs> of the dragon ball heroes characters which i thought was really funny but uh yeah this is what we have uh, this is the team we're gonna run for this time. Let's see, we're almost, uh, we're already almost done. And can we finish it here? Yep. Uh, goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this isn't very hard at all, I feel like. If you have, like, a, maybe, like, a really, really strong team, then perhaps you could cheese this. Just like that guy on Reddit did. Uh, we can go and look at the teams. A lot of people are using very different teams, you'll see, because... Well, many different teams and like, just no one has like the same hero's character, I don't know. No one goes as hard on heroes as, you know, <laughs> um, I did. I even did some summons off camera if you haven't noticed. Uh, yeah, uh, what was it, like 1250 stones total I went. And I only pulled one trunks within all those stones, so, uh, yeah, you know. Very, uh, you know, the usual funny stuff, you know. We like to do a little bit of trolling here and, uh, yeah, make me suffer. I'm sorry I didn't get that on camera, but, like, it was... I was... <laughs> I was just, like, so done with that banner. Literally 12... 1250 stones and one trunks is... It, it, it's monstrously bad luck. I wasn't even being... <laughs> I wasn't even... <laughs> entertaining like I feel like I'm not oh yeah I'm not entertaining oh that's such a surprise I don't know uh it's it, listen it's 4 30 a.m I'm trying my best uh yeah well at least these uh the easy eight battles aren't very difficult um I wouldn't we would have been fine if I had used that like full like kind of tech type build I used earlier but uh you know I just want to get done quick I gotta record I gotta record like two more videos after this, so uh yeah. Uh there's a lot of good characters you can use here. I feel like the uh one of them who just came out is the demon goddess Patine. She would be good against this 
this phase of the fight, then I guess the final phase is tech, so I don't think there's any int heroes free to play. There's uh who are they? So there's the I can't I can't even remember the free to play heroes units. I remember there's Poutine and then there's Salsa and then I feel like there should be at least there are okay, there's the um, uh, the Great Saiyaman 4 character, and then, um, what, uh, Ams, the Goku Black and Hit Fusion android thing. <laughs> yeah, that happened in Heroes. So, yeah, just looking at Heroes, as you can see, we have a few options here. Uh, not too many. Yeah, here's, uh, Ams right there. We have... Uh, the hero character, whatever his name is. All those kinds of characters, uh, there's no, unfortunately, there is no int character at the moment. Um, so I'm, I'm assuming next year we're gonna have, like, a free-to-play int character. I, I have no idea who it will be, but, um, hopefully it's a little more hype than, um, Salsa and Poutine. <laughs> hopefully. I did see some people theorizing that next year, for the Hero Celebration on Dokkan, we are going to be getting the Limit Breaker version of Super Saiyan 4 Vegito. Because some people made connections that for the 10th anniversary celebration we got um, Super Saiyan 4 Vegito, which I think was like a 9th anniversary thing of Heroes. He was like the big 9th year anniversary header of Heroes or something, and then he came out on Dokkan for uh, Hero's 10th anniversary special, and then God Trunks was the 10th anniversary special, and we got, we are getting him for the 11th anniversary, and then, uh, Hero's, uh, I, I have no idea what order it is, but I'm totally completely wrong about this, but, um, I just know that Super Saiyan 4, Vegito, and then God Trunks were big anniversary headers for Heroes, and then they came out on Dokkan later, as like later anniversary crossovers and the next in line after trunks of anniversary headers would be limit breaker super saiyan 4 vegeto so that is uh apparently what we'll have to expect next year so uh <laughs> i i should start saving my stones now really <laughs> oh my gosh uh vegeto oh boy oh and go tanks yeah i was right Okay, uh, we can do this with this team, it'll be fine. Uh, next time I am going to jump in with the, like, full int team build, and that should be, uh, it'll get us through here a lot faster. How strong is Gotenks here? Is he gonna hit really, <laughs> I mean, if he manages to hit us, are, is he gonna hit really hard? Uh, Gotenks, what are you gonna do? Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's about what I expected. Uh, so yeah, uh, not very hard. Unfortunately, you cannot cheese this with the Tech Khalifa as I don't believe anyone on this- anyone we fight here is on pure sand. Oh, by the way, I don't want to mention that this Demigra and the Meki Kabora are like amazing link sharing partners. The only link they don't have together is I believe Big Bad Bosses. Yeah, he doesn't- Demigra doesn't have big bad bosses, but he shares 6 out of 7 links. So if you just put him in the middle next to some other big bad bosses unit, I think this- Uh, he'd really really shine. Uh, okay, a bit of a rant there, but whatever. <laughs> listen, listen. It's- it's like 4.30 a.m. I just got finished recording another video talking for 20 minutes straight. I need to improvise stuff to talk about now, and then I have to record another video after this, so... Yeah, it's a shame we didn't get to see Mickey Flora's attack stat. Uh, oh well. That is it be what it be. Okay, now we can build the full attack build for heroes, so... I'm gonna switch back to God Trunks as the leader, because I feel like there's more Rainbow Friends of him. So, we may take... I might just take Vegito off for now. Let's set God Trunks as the leader. By the way, uh, I have them all awakened now. So let's bring Gohan, Vegeta, Pan, obviously, uh, the Gohanks, Gohonks. <laughs> I don't know what his name exactly is. 
And then, um, oh, here we go, Toa, I'm dumb. There we go. Uh, this is the team we're gonna be using, and we should maybe, uh, one turn this every time, especially if, if we had the, if you had the, the Super Saiyan 3 Gohan rainbow, then you would be definitely be clearing up this, these stages and fights really easily. I'm gonna do a little bit of that, and... Uh, let's just see what he does. Let's just see. Um, he's not gonna hurt us at all here. Uh, how much health will he have after being hit by these? Okay. <laughs> uh, he does not have much as it would turn up. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, thanks, Vegeta. Uh, a lot of these heroes' characters are super good with additionals. Hit him sword. Blah, blah, blah. And then we're gonna do it again. Blah, blah. Okay. <laughs> okay, uh, there we go. Very, very easy. We're at- Oh my gosh, our- Our health was almost 42069. That is- That is so hilarious. Oh my- I'm laughing so much right now. Can you guys tell how tired I am? Alright, well at least we're on stage 28. We're almost done. We're almost out of here. And then I can record one more video and then go to bed. Okay. Uh, this is gonna be another one turn because- we have like our hardest hitters here, especially Pan. Pan, the the goddess of Dokkan, one of the best units in the game, uh, misses 50% chance to dodge, 50% uh, chance to crit, supporting, uh, being insane. <laughs> yeah, that one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh yeah, they they really do go down easily. Oh, one of the disappointing things about this Gohan ZZA actually is that. He doesn't get his big attack buffs and oh my gosh, five dodge. Uh, he doesn't get his biggest attack, like his extra attack buffs until after you need to get like many, many key spheres with him, which won't be too much of a problem on the heroes team, I feel like, because you do have uh, the god Trunks, who is a rainbow orb changer. Uh, yeah, Trunks is a rainbow orb changer. The... Uh, what's her name? The the physical the physical SSR character, not Patine, the other one. Um, uh, you know her. She's one of the summonable units on the new banner. She is also a Rainbow Orb Changer, so you can run her as well on the hero's team. Uh, you can get some work out of her. She, listen, that the her and the the corrupted Supreme Kai of Time are gonna be like literally crazy when they awaken. I saw some people getting that Supreme Kai of Time for like, like 5 million attack stats and stuff. Uh, yeah, some pretty goofy stuff. Uh, I'm predicting, oh my gosh, Trunks. Wait, was that mine? Was that my Trunks? Wait, what? That wasn't my Trunks, was it? Huh? What? Why'd he hit so hard? Well, I mean, I guess it is the hero's easy, but like, what? I, I just, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Okay, Trunks. Uh, you know, I would have been even better if I had, you know, had some, had some dupes in them. But at this point, there's almost no point, uh, like, no temptation or point to summon because I have everyone on the, uh, the banner rainbowed except for him. So if I went in there, I'm like 99% just gonna be disappointed because. I just be pulling everyone else, and I can't use them because I already have them all rainbowed. Unless, oh, unless there's a chain battle, which again, that was another thing in the heroes poll I was talking, or the questionnaire that I brought up before. That was in there too, a heroes chain battle, but we didn't get that either. Uh, so you know, anytime they want to do that, I have uh, many. SSRs of heroes characters, many heroes characters rainbow that I could help my friends out with. Uh, so, uh, don't ban whenever you want to do that, whenever you want to be cool, additional pen. No! Okay. Well, we made it to turn two. Oh my. Oh my. Uh, what is this, stage 29? We have one more after this, one more, until I can stop recording? Okay. Alright, goodbye. Go tanks. There you go. Goodbye. Alright, uh, so we are moving into the final- Oh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> we are done here. Uh, so there you go. Uh, that is the Dragon Ball Heroes, uh, EZA. Uh, I feel like this isn't gonna be... 
I mean, it's hard to say how difficult this is going to be for like an average sort of player because um, I have no idea how well these like non-heroes teams are going to perform in here. If you have, uh, I, 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 I really, I really have no idea. This personally, if you do have like heroes characters, this is not going to be very difficult for you at all i feel like like look at look, look at these people they're using agl units here they're using agl units in a, a tech type easy a fight this is does this fight even have no yeah they have no um damage reduction against like all types like some of these easy a's like i'll show you right now the super saiyan 3 goku uh, i believe he takes less damage from like um, like, specific typings, like, I mean, besides AGL. Yeah, greatly reduces damage from tech, int, SDR, and physical, and then AGL super and extreme. But the Heroes 1 isn't weak to anything. Um, I could jump into this with a... Potentially, like a, like a, just an int team or something, and just see how difficult it is. But I'm on a time restraint right now, and I really don't want to do that, so... We're just gonna end the video off here, so uh, yeah, there we go. Um, as for units, I'd recommend uh, pretty much just any, uh, just any character who has type advantage in this fight, really. And if you are struggling with like maybe not having heroes characters, then maybe you could bring. Gosh, I don't know. I was gonna say you could bring the God Trunks as like your friend character, but I don't know. Because he went because the right if you don't have heroes characters and the rest of your team is getting buffs if you want to do like Vegeta's family all oh, you know what you could do actually is you could bring uh, Mr. 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 This guy as your leader and then bring the God Trunks as a friend because he's leading Vegeta's family and even if you're not hitting the the Go Tanks the hardest because you're not having Dragon Ball Heroes units. You will have Trunks will be getting like a full leader skill from his own and then Vegeta. So yeah, I don't know. If you don't have heroes, it's possible, just very, very hard. Thank you all so much for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe if you feel like it. I love you all. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.